Hey, welcome back. We're in the Gospel of Luke, chapter 4, today, verse 38 and 39. Jesus just cast out some demons, and the word's gone out. Let's see what happens here. Now he arose from the synagogue and entered into Simon's house, but Simon's wife's mother was sick with a high fever, and they made request of him concerning her. So he stood over her and rebuked the fever, and it left her. And immediately she arose and served them. Okay, so some different bits here. First of all, he just before this, yesterday morning, we read about how he cast out demons. Uh, now here we have him, and he's casting out a illness, a disease. He heals this woman immediately. Boom, she's healed of the disease, just like that. Now, then she gets up to serve him and say, well, that's, that's kind of gross, isn't it? I mean, Jesus heals her, and what does he expect her to wait on him hand and foot? But this is her response, the response of a, of, a, of a joyful heart. She's not sick anymore. What is the first impulse that she wants to do? She wants to serve him. And when God does good things for you and I, what should our first response be? We should want to serve him. But we're such a narcissistic society today. We're so so worried about ourself. You know, hey, how did my latest selfie look? We've got this, you know, how did my latest this or that? How, what are people thinking about that? We have this kind of uh, skewed view. It's all about me. It's all about me. No, it's not all about me. It's about Jesus. It's about Jesus. And so I love the spirit of this woman who Jesus comes, he stands over her, he calls out, and she's, she's healed. It's not a demon issue here, it's an illness issue, and he heals her. Jesus is able to heal us. And many times he allows our sicknesses to remain because he's going to use the, those to bring out a greater good. But we notice here he has power over all illness, and we want to remember that whenever we are suffering from illness. But I would wish that in my heart, and perhaps in yours, that we would have a spirit of service to Jesus. Service to Jesus. The world would be a better place if everybody had a service, spirit of service to Jesus. Let's pray. Father in heaven, we are so used to self-serving, we almost don't know how to serve anyone else. Lord, help us to have the response that this woman had when Jesus healed her. Help us, as you heal us, help us to desire to serve you and be, be instant to know how we can serve you. Help us to know that, Lord. Bless, we pray, and we ask in Jesus' name, amen. May you and I find service to Jesus even this day. That's our prayer. God bless you.